Yo, what's good, YouTube? What's going on? Me and my boy Scar are going to watch some MK1 matches of Sonic Fox versus Ninja Killer. You guys are very familiar with those two. People think they are the, you know, arguably, arguably the two best in the world. And uh, it's a brand new game, so I expect them to have some good combos and have a decent understanding of the game. This video is um, on Sonic's Fox's channel. I'm gonna drop credit to Sonic's channel in my description so you can watch the original <laughs> video. I did get some time with the game. Pretty cool, still some work to be done. Pretty sure that version of the game, the stress test that we got was earlier build. So after playing the stress test, I went back, watched the trailer. So I got high hopes for this game. Hopefully once it does come time for it to drop, no, it's a more solid game but from what i did play it was it was pretty cool this video is 42 minutes long i don't plan on watching all 42 minutes i just hope that um you know the first few matches we'll probably watch a couple matches hopefully they had some good sets in the beginning it's pretty good if he holds it then he's safe and if he holds it all the way then he's plus oh my god his character hurts that was off a jump kick Oh my god, you're lagging! You're lagging! <laughs> okay, Sonic has Kano for cameo. I see a lot of Luke King players have Sonya for the cameo. I'm guessing she's probably the best combo extender for him. At least in the beta. Yeah, she was the best combo extender, but over the course of the beta, a lot of people was using Kano. It seemed like he was the best with, cameo. With Luke King? Um, no, not with Luke King, but uh... But a majority of the characters, people were using Kano, like Sub, Kenshi. I had to go to was um, I think Jax was like the least played cameo. Hmm, hard knockdown. Hmm, cameo breaker. I think breakers come back really fast in this game. Uh, oh, that, that would have been a nice combo extension oh if God, the game edge. didn't have negative edge. Oh, you Neg can't turn it off? Nah, you couldn't turn it off in a beta. It was very annoying, bro. You had to be like super precise with your inputs in order to get what you wanted. Okay, get out of here. <laughs> I'm chilling, bro. Get out of here. Yo, shout out to whoever made this track for this stage. This track goes in. More than that, buddy. Character hurts, bro. They put you in a messed up situation. You gotta guess. That was overhead, but he didn't hit it. You can get a combo extender off the uh, ghost. Shit looks like a. I was watching a little bit of that string. It looks kind of like it has the same MK11 mind game. Doesn't it have a gap between the third and fourth hit? Oh, uh. Yeah. You could flawless okay. block. Yeah. yeah. You could. Flawless block. The, the, I think you can flawless block at any point of the string in this game. Uh, but if you flawless block like the last hit of that string, get a punish. Mm. That's nice armor. Oh, I didn't do. Oh my fucking god, I didn't do that. <laughs> yeah, the break there. He's gonna explode, bro. <laughs> oh yes. Optimal. My god. Dude, 47 and the fucking yep. puppet is out there. 47 into a sandwich. That was a very brave wake up. He could have, like, died. Blocked it. Is that string safe? What's that? The launcher? From Luke? Um, I'm not sure. This is like. I've seen a few videos of people just throwing that shit on block and nobody Oh, you know what? All his launchers are, are safe. Well, I think you could probably... Well, no. It's actually unblockable, right? Because mm -hmm. Jax has that uh, move that he does when you call him out. It's actually unblockable. And it breaks armor. Oh, he's dead. Yes, he is, sir. Don't let at me. Ah, YouTube. I think he was getting like well over 1k. I think at one point his highs could be wrong, probably like 2k. I saw Sonic had like 4k. Yeah, Sonic had a ridiculous amount of. Views. Shit was nuts. 
Yeah, that's definitely safe. Plus. Plus, plus. Okay, so he does a string, calls cameo, and then gets the puppet out. Yeah. It's cheap. The only drawback is like, when he's at that, so that's the stance he's in right now is Sento stance, and once you go in that stance, it's kind of hard to get out of it safely. You have to like really call, hope you got a cameo in order to get out of that stance. Can you and block in that stance? Yeah, he can block. It's just, you can't like get out of that stance safely in the neutral without calling an assist. And then he loses, um, depending on what stance you're in, you, you lose your zoning abilities. So he can't really zone you while he's in Sento. Yeah. That was a punish right there. Good at that. Oh, man. Yeah. I think that move is safe too. You grab me? That's like his only projectile that he gets in that stance. Mm. It's an EX move. Oh my god! Hmm, side switch combo. Side switch combo and corner carry. Thirty-three. So I see that, you know, Luke King EXs his fireball. It enables him to not do the flying kick portion. He just gets the extension. Mm -hmm. But if he lets it rock, he does the fireball, then the flying kick. Yeah. So, okay, that's cool. This combo rides like easy as fuck. I'm not gonna lie. Nah, it's like MK9, Lou. You know, like ABC. Yeah. Looping the same string. Oh my god, it breaks the that breaks, that breaks projectiles. I didn't know that. Yeah, that Kano I beam is hella punishable. Even if you do it from like full screen. Set up. 41. You got a guess? Alright, uh, you didn't block. So why is that a guess? So you waking up, Kenshi still has the, the opportunity to block while his ghost can still move around. So it's like, oh, I, he can block, but the ghost can still attack you. You know, so it's like, you can armor, sure, but... There's not a guaranteed chance you're going to get anything from it, you know? Uh, yeah. So, yeah. he literally just, you might as well just take it. Yeah, you might as well just block and hope you block right. Oh, my God. You delayed it. Overhead low attacks that are only comboable from the puppet. And then he has, um, he has a block infinite <laughs> as long as the ghost is out. So he, that swipe that you just see him do, that two hit swipe. Now I'm playing this character. That's so... Potato. Yeah, that two hit and swipe, you can do it, and then Kenshi does a two hit and swipe, and it just loops itself. And you can armor it, but Kenshi can still block. So you have to, you have to really pray that he's not blocking when you do your armor. Get off. Bam. Oh, it's okay. Get me out of here, Kano. Get me out of here, Kano. Yeah, just... Is that push safe? Uh, like safe? So no when matter he did how it right... long he holds it. No, when he did it... it right there, that was unsafe. He just. He played the mind Happen game. Yeah, he just played the mind game. Look at that. That was nice. Oh my God. Uh, appreciate you, Sonic, by the way, for uh, blessing me with the permission to basically steal your content and react to it. Back to. Kenchi, way more Kenchi than he's ever fucking been. Yeah. He said he hates the dash, or they said they uh, hate the dash block in the game. Yeah. Forward, forward, down to cancel your block. So weird. Oh, this is Kenji's crib, huh? No, Johnny's. Oh, I just saw the swords. I thought. Yeah, but Johnny, I guess, because in the trailer, I guess Johnny has his sword. 
Mm. So he seeks out Johnny to get it back. Oh wow. Yeah. CT is about to be a fucking bloodbath. Oh. Oh, come on, Sonic. Oh my. Yeah. What? So. So does the puppet only stay out for a certain amount of time or a certain amount of attacks or what? Yes, yeah, he stays out for a certain amount of time, but the thing is. If it runs out, you can EX and he comes back. What the? Yeah. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Of course, I didn't get the entire middle of the, the video, but you know, just from the brief shit I saw, Sonic's Kenji was looking. I mean, Sonic, of course, had way more time than ninja with the game overall but sonic's kenchi looked like the the highlight i mean this is sonic's channel as well so sonic's gonna definitely make themselves look elite but definitely the superstar of the of the set i think unless i'm you know wrong and just didn't watch the entire video i watched the majority of it when it was <clears> live <throat> and yeah kenchi was giving uh ninja killers new uh Liu Kang. All the time. I mean, the character just looks fucked up on knockdown. Kenshi had way more resources as far as having that ghost and Kano as a cameo. It's versus, like you have two cameos. Yeah, versus like, yeah. Liu Kane only gets help from Sonya really when he gets a launch, when he has to get the hit. Yeah. Right. It seems like Sonya for Liu Kane just adds to his Combo damage extension, yeah. and not necessarily the mix or Nooch. Yeah, because Sonic was doing stuff like calling Kano out, Kano throw. And then brings out the puppet. Yeah. And then gets a free puppet summon in the middle of a block string by just simply summoning the puppet during Kano's knife toss. Mm -hmm. So that's fucked up. All, the only time I really saw Sonya was when uh, Ninja was just trying to cash out. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Which is, is cool. I guess it just, you know, maybe uh, Ninja and just Liu Kang players in general are going to have to, you know, go around the cameo roster and see, you know, who compliments Liu Kang's tool set the most in neutral as well. Cause they're, you know, the game's fucking only, it's the game's not even out. So, so Sonya, all she might be able to do is add to his combos, but there might be another cameo that adds to the neutral and yeah. you're going to have to value. What do you need more damage or, or neutral, but appreciate y'all for watching. Take it easy.